What's up, my YouTubers? How's it going today? Today we're going to do another uh, screen mirroring video, uh, actually screen recording, and uh, this one's going to be a quick tutorial on how to use Find a Grave. Uh, I don't know if a lot of people out there actually would have a use for this other than trying to hunt down some, some of their ancestry or their uh, ancestors from other areas, but this is a great website. It's actually been uh, in the last few years purchased by Ancestry.com, so they've uh, really helped this uh, kind of move along. What it, what it is is actually just just a, a, a user base that actually goes out, takes pictures of, of cemetery head markers, and of course, uh, you know, times sometimes they link obituaries, and of course, that's really helpful, especially in my business where I do have to do a lot of hunting down of people and uh, get see where they lived or see what their family is like. Uh, so I have to do a lot of airship and ancestry work. Uh, we call that skip tracing. So what I uh, use this a lot for is, let's say I'm searching for a memorial, you can search by cemetery. I'll go ahead and push that. Let's say I was looking for uh, Johnson, first name Laverne, and I know that you know you can search by a middle name, birth. You can do uh, birth and death year before, in, or after a certain date, uh, and then of course the cemetery. Uh, so I'll, to, I'll choose a. a the country, United States, and I'm going to come down here to, uh, I know that she passed away in, uh, I think it was Texas, so, and I'll go ahead and click, you know, you can come down here to the county as well, and we're going to look for Crosby County, and that'll actually be uh, in West Texas, and of course, I've got those already in there, I'm going to hit search, and there she is, that's exactly the person I'm looking for, you can help verify that by De um, date of births, their date of deaths, if you know anything like that. Of course, it tells you where they were at, what county they uh, they died in, where they um, where they were born. Uh, it tells a little bit about their family, her quick bio, what what cemetery she's actually buried in, and of course, the bottom is who created it actually. So you know, I can always always hit these family links and actually jump into someone uh, their their family. So you know, that's uh, that was his wife, and you can tell that uh, you know where she was born and where she died, and the rest of her family. And then it, great, you know, this one also linked in through a uh, uh, obituary, so I'm actually able to understand what that family was and who was close and who who predeceased her who who survived her so this works extremely uh well for my uh my job and we do this uh almost on a daily basis uh a lot of times looking for people uh so yeah hope that one works it's a great app to use when you're using ancestry and wanting to know some of your uh ancestry uh, and and family tree so as always uh, feel free if this video helped you feel free to comment like subscribe to us and uh, can't wait to see you guys in another one Later, guys.